The suspects were apprehended by residents nearby who saw the freshly chopped head in a taxi cab with registration number GW 5532-21 and later handed them over to the police after the vehicle was involved in an accident. An eyewitness to the incident, Daniel Maiga, spoke to City News. City news sources say one of the suspects involved in the act is a taxi driver and lured his accomplice, also another taxi driver, to assist him carry out the action for a handsome reward. He reportedly convinced the other accomplice that human sacrifice was another avenue that fetched him money and also needed human head to sacrifice for a chieftaincy position. The two hired the services of a taxi driver and later slaughtered him at the sun winning site at the outskirts of Hobo Township and whilst they were making away with the head, got involved in an accident. The entire community is crippled with fear. Peter Adonu, assemblyman for Hobo, while speaking to City News on the incident, called for enhanced security in the area. None of them is known. The incident creates a difference in and panic to the, the residents within Hobo electoral area because this is the first time of experiencing this. And today, is a taxi driver who we did not know him. But probably tomorrow, if it's not you, it will be me or my son or my daughter. So that creates a great or big confusion, fear and panic to the people in my community, including myself. The chief, Togbi Hobo, and the opinion leaders in the community, including the assembly member, myself, we are appealing to the government that we can't take the law into our own hands. That's why we are calling to the government to come to our aid with security 24 seven, so that the, uh, the panic in the people will reduce, so that it can help the day-to-day -day activity in the community. <laughs>